guys hope you all are doing so well before i start this video if you have not subscribed please subscribe like and share and don't forget to click on the notification bell that will enable you to know whenever i upload a new video today we are talking about love language yes what is your love language i would love to know what your language is you put it in the comment section let me know okay yeah so today i will i'm talking about love language okay we live in a society where people pretend as if they don't love money when you stay with someone and you tell that person oh i love money and you know they will start looking at you as if you are vain or that that's you don't want to be if in terms of relationship they'll be looking at you as if you don't want to be in a proper relationship that all you want is money as if they don't love money as if they don't go out every day to look for money you tell someone that you someone that you really love you know that you know that there's some things that he needs to provide for the relationship to go he start looking at you as if your aim is just to come collect from him and move on <laughs> see there is more when we talk about relationship you can't sit down and be telling someone every day morning and night i love you i love you i love you without sacrifice when you love somebody is you need to sacrifice and money and other things and you know in creating time for the person and communicating with the person when we talk about relationship we cannot talk about relationship without money this is a, a, a word that so many people find it difficult to say you tell somebody that whenever maybe you have someone that you you love and most times or sometimes you want to discuss money with a person and the person will be looking at you as if he or she has seen a ghost <laughs> the people pretend people pretend a lot especially when they hear about money in the part of the world that i came from <laughs> the part of the country that i came from you know africa nigeria when you a lady is always talking about money they you know most of the time they see you as if you're just money conscious i know it is not only in africa it's also in every part of the world but people look at you and say oh she's always talking about money 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 but you want money too why are we pretending why are you pretending as if you don't love money why are you pretending as if having money is a curse will you prefer poverty then will you prefer to be poor you ask people what is their love language most of the time what you hear is oh i need a quality time i need a physical touch and as uh, you know words of affirmation uh, all those stuff see all those things are good okay me as i'm sitting down here talking to you about love language if you ask me what my love language is one of them will be money because you can't be in a relationship without sacrifice. You can't be in a relationship without giving. For God so loved the world that he gave. And you, you that, that, is, that is on earth and you, you believe that you cannot give. Nobody is saying that you should put all your mind in money, money, money. No. You, when you, no, but at least you should do something. You can't say you love this person, you can't buy that person a dress or a clothes or, no, or whatever. On her birthday, you're bringing up unnecessary stories. You can't sacrifice, but you want it all. You want, you know, to be, to be at the receiving end, but you do not want to give. Remember when you give, you receive. But when you do not give, you keep falling. Some, things, some of the things that are happening to people today is not because they are not working hard. It's because they don't give. So one of my, your hosts, as I'm talking today, one of my love language is money. You need money to take care of yourself. You need money to take care of the people around you. You need, you need money to eat, to maintain your relationship, to give to someone else that do not have. Are you going to sit down and be looking and be saying eh, every time you're just asking about money? Do I even need to ask you about money before you bring up money to do what you want to do? If you are in a relationship with someone, that person don't need to come asking you for money. You should know what to do in a relationship. 
You said, oh, she she's always asking me for money for this. Uncle, which one have you given? Which what which one have you done? That or have how many things have you done that you just conclude that she's just there to look for money? Or you, auntie, it's not only for men. You as a lady, you have someone that is doing for you every time. What have you done for him? What is what have you contributed to that relationship? If you're in a relationship with someone, both male and female, both of you should contribute. It is not only for a man or a, for a lady. It is a com combined effort. So if you want to build your relationship, you need to contribute and make, make it work. You ask somebody your love, love language, you say quality time. Quality time is important. If someone loves you, the person will create time for you. He will not be bringing unnecessary excuse when he or she is supposed to be with you. If you love somebody, you will always want to talk to that person. So there is no excuse why you shouldn't talk to this person in a day. Physical touch, yes. If you if you care about somebody, you will you know you will be closer to you will always want to be close to the person. Out of service, you want to serve, you want to do things. All those things are very very important. But you cannot achieve all those things if you do not have money. So one of my love language, if you are looking at me today, is money. If you talk about physical touch, quality time and all that, and there is no money, and you think it's going to be nice, we will just be pretending because this person will be going to someone else to get look for money, and another person will be going to another person to look for money, and we'll be meeting together pretending as if we love for ourselves and we don't need money. At the end of the day, who are you deceiving? You have just ended up deceiving yourself. You just ain't it. You see some lady, some guys. They will tell you, I love that guy because she doesn't ask me for money. But she's looking good. She's buying things, and she's looking so pretty. And you don't know where she, he or she is getting the money from. And you are saying that you love him or her because she doesn't ask you for money. So you will see the girl, she will be looking good and you don't even know how she makes her money. That means another person, there's someone somewhere that is actually giving her money. And you are claiming, oh, she loves you too much, she's not collecting money from you. Look, let me tell you, there's someone somewhere that is giving her the money that you are enjoying. So whatever thing you want to do, just know that money is important. You can't say, oh, my, I, you know, my love language is just... Um, uh, words of affirmation. Words of affirmation is very good when you tell somebody, oh, you're looking good, you're looking, they are very, very good. But all those things that you are admiring on, on someone's life, what is your, what are you, what have you contributed to those things that you see and they look good and flashy to you? What, what, you know, have you contributed in putting those things in the life of that person? Anybody that will tell you, oh, I don't like money, dear, you're always talking about money, you are doing, that person doesn't know what he or she is talking about. We pretend a lot, you know, we live in a society where people pretend a lot as if, as if money is a curse, as if they don't love money. But at the end of the day, you see them going around begging for money. So one of my, my own love language is money. I've said it here several, several times, I've said it. Because when you have money, you'll be able to, do other things you want to do and also achieve other things you want to achieve. If you have money, you know, when you sacrifice to somebody, there's something that you also need money. You, you cannot be even in a relationship with, without, without, the, the money is very important when it comes to being in a relationship. If you want to argue, you can argue or you're in your house or argue with anybody or you can also tell me what you think about this topic in the comment section i would love to hear what you have to say concerning this particular uh, topic people always say look at that lady she likes money if you have money before you that is talking don't you like money is money your enemy don't you don't you like money don't you want money in your life you pretend as if you don't have want money you see people that, you know, you see people that want money, you that have money, you are jealous of them. And you see them beauty, you say, man, that girl is just holding that guy because the guy has money. Uncle, what, what is holding you? Why can't you just go make your own money? Every other thing is important in a relationship. 
you know, being caring to the other person, you know, telling the person how this how this person look, doing stuff for this for uh, for the person and the person you're going out with and all those stuff, even your friends or relation or whatever. But you need money too to solve your issues, to solve some other things, okay? So you cannot, I believe that you cannot talk the language of love if without having without money. Money should money is important. Money is important. You can't just wake up in the morning and sit down and say, I tell your wife, I love you, I love you, I love you. My dear, there are, they have bills to pay. There are bills to pay. There are children to, 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 to send to school. There are relations, families that are coming to you. There, are you. there are rents to pay. There are things you need money to build that relationship, to make your partner happy. So anybody that will, whenever they talk about money, they say, mm, she always like money. Like, See, you're talking to the wind, okay? If you're, talk, if you're telling me, oh, oh, say, for instance, she always like money, she always do that. You are not talking to me. Because you need money to look good. You need money to take care of those around you, to feed yourself, even to feed. You need money to clothe yourself. You need money, you need money to look good, to take care of yourself. So my own love language is money. Let me know what your love language is. Okay? I'll be stopping here today. You always stay true to yourself and have a beautiful day. Always feel free to share my videos with your family, friends, and those around you. Share it with anybody, your colleagues in the office. Share my videos with them. Let me know what you think. Let me, I want to know what, know what you think about this, this topic. You always stay true to yourself and have a beautiful and a lovely day. Bye-bye.